नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज इलेक्ट्रोमैग्नेटिक रेडिएशन ऑफ वेवलेंथ 242 नैनोमीटर इज जस्ट सफिशिएंट टू आयोनाइज द सोडियम एटम सो व्हिच मींस टू आयोनाइज दिस टू रिमूव एन इलेक्ट्रॉन फ्रॉम सोडियम एटम 242 नैनोमीटर वेवलेंथ इज मोर देन इनफ सो दैट मींस वी नीड टू कैलकुलेट व्हाट इज द एनर्जी रिक्वायर्ड इन टर्म्स ऑफ किलो जूल पर मोल सो हियर फर्स्ट लेट्स अंडरस्टैंड व्हाट यू मीन बाय आयोनाइज सो व्हिच मींस we have sodium atom here when you say you want to ionize you're pulling out an electron from here this will become na plus and one electron is coming out now this is the ionization of sodium atom so here this is nothing but energy possessed by electromagnetic radiation with wavelength 242 nanometer is 1 e so here what we are going to do is we are going to calculate what is the energy required for it so therefore energy is equal to because we have wavelength we will get our formula in terms of wavelength which is hc by lambda now lambda here is in terms of nanometer we need to convert it to meter so 1 nanometer equals 10 to the power minus 9 meter so here therefore 242 nanometer equals 242 into 10 to the power minus 9 meters so here we'll put all the values h is planck's constant so h is equal to 6.626 into 10 to the power minus 34 joule second c is velocity of light 3 into 10 to the power 8 meter per second lambda value is what we have here so let's substitute all these values here this will be equal to 6.626 into 10 to the power minus 34 joule second into 3 into 10 to the power 8 meter per second divided by lambda value is 242 10 to the power minus 9 meter meter and meter will get cancelled seconds and inverse and seconds will get cancelled when we simplify this we will get 0.082140 into 10 to the power Minus nine goes up; it will become plus nine. When we simplify all the powers, it will become minus seventeen joules. When we shift the decimal here by two places, this will be eight point two one four zero ten to the power minus nineteen joules. So here, when we say that this is the energy required for one sodium atom, so we write here ionization. enthalpy of one sodium atom equals 8.2140 into 10 to the power minus 19 joules therefore avogadro number of joules avogadro number of sodium atom equals cross multiply them this will be 8.2140 into 10 to the power minus 19 joules into sorry here there is a mistake this is 8.2140 into 6.022 into 10 to the power 23 atoms divided by 1 atom so when we simplify this you will get 10 to the power 4 joules now this is the energy required uh, as per the question but it clearly says and the ionization energy should be in terms of kilo joule and not in joules so here 1 kilo joule equals 10 to the power 3 joules therefore you need to find out how many kilo joules you have to find out so i'm just taking it as x which is equal to this 49.464 into 10 to the power 4 joules so this one just do unitary method 
49.464 10 to the power 4 joules into 1 kilojoule divided by 10 to the power 3 joule. Now this will be equal to and we simplify all of this it will be 49.464 10 to the power 1 kilojoule this will be 494.46 kilojoule so this is going to be the answer for calculate ionization energy per mole that's why we had to calculate in terms of mole also convert it to atoms and find out